Good morning, guys. We're back here, and welcome to the vlog. It's vlog number 46, and it is Tuesday, August 13th at 8.05. A little bit later in the morning, uh, not for any particular reason. Uh, I did make coffee already. It's good for a Tuesday morning. Also, I've been having too much extra coffee um, when I leave for work, so I didn't want to waste it. So I wanted to go ahead and get a cup in, uh, then I'll take some with me to work. So, yesterday, uneventful. Uh, no, not really much to talk about. Uh, went to work, came home, streamed, normal. Uh, streamed a little later, but besides that, it was just like bog standard day. But what I did want to talk about in this vlog, which I thought would be fun, is something way in the past. Uh, I kind of thought about it this morning as I woke up, it was like scrolling and fiddling through Facebook, is marching band. Uh, I was in the marching band uh, from... Sixth grade all the way th uh, throughout high school. Uh, well, sixth grade through eighth grade was like concert band for middle school. Um, and then ninth through twelfth is actual marching band. Well, marching band, fall, spring is concert band uh, or symphonic band, depending on your grade level. Anyway, that's all technical stuff. Uh, but I seen some posts about, you know, band camp either going on right now or just finished for the, my band back home and it brought back a lot of memories uh i loved marching band i was a marcher at heart uh, i loved every second of being on the field um, i was a trumpet player uh, which i could say is the best instrument and be a stereotypical trumpet player but I'll, there's a lot of good instruments uh, i like brass uh, i would love to have learned the saxophone i think they're pretty nifty but uh yeah, I seen campus going on. Uh, they were thinking all the different leadership and different people who were attending. And, you know, it makes me reminiscent of those days. Uh, I'd love to have, you know, I'm five hours away right now from home, but just going back and hanging out is really fun. Uh, seeing the band and Huckabee and everyone there is, you know, would have been great, but a little far for that. Um, but, so, what shows did I do? Uh, marching band are... You know, reminiscence, they'll do shows and they'll go compete and do such. And each year you have a different show. Uh, my freshman year was probably hands down my favorite. Uh, we did a Pearl Harbor themed show, which was really cool. Um, and it was a, a very good show. It com like competed well. Uh, the crowd always loved it. Uh, standing ovations usually. And it was very impactful, I want to say. Uh, that show was broken. Most shows have three parts, uh, like a opening part, middle, and like inclusion kind of thing. You know, first part, second part, third part, and then that's how you break it up and practice it. Uh, we had a like very like poppy. I don't want to say I don't know if it was a poppy like a eighties kind of feeling intro with like some swings and jazz. Um, then we had an actual like war battle you know cyber and raid kind of uh middle phase with uh mostly percussion and drum line and then like a remembrance phase for the uh like the final and the third one uh but it was a lot of fun uh i got to actually like do some stuff with the color guard which was a lot of fun got to do some dancing uh with a senior which was as a freshman it was like because <sighs> uh, she was uh, very attractive, and I was a very awkward freshman. Um, but yeah, that was uh, my first year. Second year, what was second year? Sophomore year was, I want to say it was the Sunday crossword, uh, which was a very, like, out in left field kind of show. Uh, and we did, like, songs. Pretty much we had a set of of words we were trying to complete in to make a you know, finish out a crossword puzzle, as it would be. Uh, so we had some James Bond in there. We had, I think we had some uh, dueling banjos. It was a lot of, like, mishmash stuff. Uh, it's a lot of fun. I don't remember. It's a little fuzzy because it's been, I don't know, six, six, seven years ago, something like that. Because, what, that was before, so five would put me at senior year, six, junior, yeah, seven years ago. That's pretty good. Spot on. Um, but yeah, it was, it was a really good show. It just doesn't stick as well as Pearl Harbor does. Uh, third year, junior year was, 
um, Polar Express, but that season got cut short because of some stuff that was going on in the band. Uh, a lot of problems was like going on with between students and the director. Plus, uh, there was, you know, some student issue that happened that really messed up the band, and uh, so that one we didn't actually get to complete the season, which you know kind of sucks as a junior going into your final season as a senior. But I felt worse for the seniors who that was their last year competing. So, because I think it was, I, I don't know if we went to even one competition or if we, we might have went to one or two. So, but that was, that was Polar Express. Uh, not very fond memories. Not really good ones. And then finally, senior year, uh, what, we did a rock and roll show, which was a lot of fun. I actually, on my senior year, got to assist as a drum major, which was a lot of fun. Uh, drum majors are the student led people who, the students who, you know, lead and conduct the show. Um, I actually started up the show in the back, so I got to be a drum major and still march and play, which was a lot of fun. Um, it's a very unique circumstance, so I got to do that. And then I got to assist in pep band, which is uh, a lot of fun. You would think that, you know, you're just going to support the football team, but no, you're there supporting them. You're just hanging out with your friend. I bumped the mic. Um, uh, just like ch chilling. It's, you know, there's not no pressure to put on a show, really. Uh, especially if it's an away game, you're just there in the stands to, uh, you know, make some noise and, you know, interrupt the other team if you can and just hang out. Um, those were way more fun than home games. Home games, you still had to put on your show during halftime. So there was like a little bit of like, you know, formality there. But uh, away games were where it was at. But yeah, uh, rock and roll show was a lot of fun. What was also a lot of fun is part of that year... I want to say it was in the spring. We went to Disney and we uh, did a parade and we uh, played some pieces, which was a ton of fun. I think my sophomore year we went to Virginia and did some stuff uh, like Lynchburg, Virginia, which was not as much fun because during that one we were doing a lot of running and doing. No, that was my freshman year. Sophomore year was Gator Bowl, where we went down to Florida and played a halftime show at the Gator Bowl and a parade. And maybe a competition. It it was not as much fun. It was a really big trip. But it wasn't as much fun because we were always going. We had rehearsals and practices and, you know, performances. And it really took away from, you know, being able to enjoy being there. Whereas the Disney trip, yes, we still had a parade and stuff. But we had, like, a week down there and I think one, one like, competition. Oh, well, it wasn't a competition. We just, I think we, we were, as, blah, blah, blah. we were part of a parade that went through Disney. Um, so it was really fun, but it was like, you know, one afternoon while we were down there for a week. So we actually got to enjoy the park, hang out with friends. Um, a lot of fun memories. Uh, if you're, you know, a parent who's going to have kids or, you know, someone who might have kids eventually, uh, band's good. Band's a lot of fun. Um, I think it builds a lot of character, a lot of like, you know, you can bond with all these people. Uh, you make a lot of great friends and it's like a lot of, you build a lot of character, and especially depending on the band you're with, you build a lot of great skills, leadership skills, uh, you know, determining skills, you know, competition skills, base skills that really, you know, have made a difference in my life, um, and I think make a difference in, you know, a lot of the people who were my friends in band who I see doing all these amazing things now. But that's a thing of the past. Uh, I miss it a lot. But, you know, every day is a different day. And hopefully I'll pick up another hobby that's just as much fun. But I wanted to share a tidbit about me. I uh, didn't have nothing interesting happen yesterday. So I thought this was a good time just to do a little sharing. All right, guys, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I'm looking for questions down in the comments. If you have any and would like to drop them down there, I'd be much appreciated. I uh, uh, can't talk this morning. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.